All right, everyone, we're going to take a quick look at Cosmos here. So it's been a minute since we looked at Cosmos. And notice I did draw a new line on the chart here. This green line down here could potentially be the bottom because you can see we're down below the 236 support here once again at 912. And this green box here is going from the low here to the high. That is your 618 and your 786 retracements here. So you can see we already hit the 786 on that candle and we got a nice little bounce going. So I would simply say as long as this green box holds here, we may push back through that $9 range. So look for anywhere for support at about 852 all the way down to about 7, what is that? 733 here uh, could be support here. Now with that being said, you can see we could do a simple measurement here. You could potentially, if you do not get back over that 236, drop about 16.5% here. And then we have a other support line here at about a 25 to 26% drop. And you can see that is sitting currently at about 653. And the reason for that line here is because if you notice back here, we have support here, support here, and support here. So it could act as a bottom on Cosmos here. So just keep an eye on that. Any lower than those three support levels, then you are coming all the way back down here to that wick bottom. Uh, and dropping about 37% back down to 554, which I do not think is going to happen. Um, if you look back in history, that is just one wick within the last couple of years down to that price level here. So I would focus on the box here and then maybe the green line here. But with that being said, we are below the 382 on Cosmos, so you are not bullish. We're below the 236. So until we get over the 236, the bottom potentially is not in here. And as of right now on the weekly candles, it is acting as resistance here with that wick spawning in. So we'll see what happens. So watch those uh, levels for support. And if we get a nice move going up here, we need to move up about 4% and get over that 236. And then we should shoot right up to the 382 at 1240. And we're looking at about a 40% move. So until we get over this 1240 level and hold that, uh, this thing is not bullish right now. Now, as for how high Cosmos can potentially go, if we're going to break the previous high, according to this chart here on Coinbase, you can see that the next level or the next stop would be about $81 over 45, and that would give you roughly a $31 billion market cap here on uh, uh, Cosmos. So you can see that's about an 8x going from where we are today. So what do you guys think? What are your opinions on Cosmos? Not financial advice, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.